Hey there beautiful people, what's up, what's going on, are you good? My name is Chris as always and I'm very very glad to hear guys. Today I'm going to show you how to configure the Cisco router passwords so as to secure our devices. Uh, when we are starting to configure our devices, it is very necessary to uh, establish some passwords so as to enhance the security in the first place. I'm having a router here and I'm going to show you how to configure all the passwords. I will configure uh, five passwords exactly and I want you to follow along. First of all, let me name my, my devices to so someone legit, something legit. Uh, I'm going to to make it Hano Media Office. This is the name of my router. And my PC is going to be called, okay, it's going to be called like, like um, admin. Uh, there are some practices that I have seen many lecturers and other network experts do uh, of going inside the router and they can access the network, uh, the this command line interface they can go and configure in this way but when you bring it in the physical way this can't be possible and don't get it with that how we were we were taught so what we can practice for the proper things the proper things uh, to configure our router uh, or any other switch or a firewall is to use a console cable here you can uh, put it on our pc like this one and you can configure in this way you can put on the console so that you can interact or with a router using a computer there's no way you can interact with the router itself i don't know if you are smart enough to do that so go in the uh, pc go to the desktop go on the terminal and you can leave these as defaults go ahead and press ok and as you can see you can see now we are on our exec mode uh, so as we can now try to set our password to so set our password first of all we try to press enable and we can go on conf configure terminal like this one uh, configure terminal press enter and the first password that we can uh, do is the enable password when we are trying to enable here we didn't have any password so uh, in order to to be able to enter these modes you can uh, go ahead and uh, type um, for enable to to make the enable password enable and put uh password and you can put your password as you need it so i can go ahead and put hano media like this one one go ahead and press enter and you can light do right to save the configuration and that is the password for the enable when you try to check if it worked you can go ahead and type exit like this one when you try to enable you can see now it is asking you for the password go ahead and put it in there so you are ready to go let's go you let's go ahead in the configuration again conf t and as we were starting i was telling you that it is very very good to use the console port of the router to make the configuration while you are using the packet tracer or uh, but the console itself have to have the security too so to make the security for the console you go ahead and type line console zero and after you do that you can type password uh, let's call it how can we call this one let's call it we love learning like this one and you can now set the execution or the timeout session we can put it to five and do this console and what you can go and do is we use this for login and you can type logging synchronous so as to avoid all the logs or all the sync command from interrupting our keyboard input go ahead and press enter and do right to save the configuration exit uh, and exit again when we try to exit as we are exiting through the interface it will ask us for the verification so as to be able to enter the router again so i can go ahead and put my password to was we love running and if you try to enable to it will ask for the enable password you can put our password that we made earlier it is hano media one uh, wrong password hano media one all right so we can go in the configuration mode too uh right yes okay and the, another password that you can do that is a uh, work a bureau of the same like enable password is the enable secret to make it you can go ahead and type enable secret and you can put let me put cisco 
syscore one two three four five and do right oh jeez okay you can go ahead and do right do right after that you can move to the fourth password which is now the vty password or the run vty password or the ethernet password if you don't know what ethernet password is or a vty password is it is uh, that in some cases we will need to access our router in the remote way and that is the the clever thing or the, the, the smart thing to do when you can try to access the router where you are away it is can be very handy when you want to fix some errors and things when you are not in the workplace so to configure that one you go ahead to and go in the configuration mode you type line v2i um line v2i oh jeez, line v2i and you can put the initialization and you put for after now you are in the run v2i you can type uh, for example let me type password and uh, let me type chris is fun like this one chris is fun enter and you can also set the uh, the timeout this the session timeout to uh let me say five seconds to that zero and after you can make this as a login and you can also put the login synchronous to avoid those sync messages to interrupt our keyboard um then enter and exit the other thing that you can do for our password to be secure is to uh use the command that is called service password encryption um, uh, password encryption like this one but before we do this i have to show you a quick thing before encrypting so let's say that someone was able to enter this uh, mode and he can see all the password in plain text when we try to show learning config uh you can see when you try to scroll down we we'll see that our password that is are stored are stored in uh, a, 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 a a clear text a print text as we can see like here and this is very very dangerous so that's why we have to encrypt our passwords so we go on the conf t and we will type service password uh, passwords encryption press enter and we can also put what we call a banner uh so as to to warn for the users who want to access our routers or our switches unauthorized uh to see what is here now unauthorized access is prohibited like this one enter exit when you try to show running config again uh you can see now our password are encrypted which is very good okay let's see okay and you can see all, also our banner is now here okay we can go ahead and check if this is working uh, and you can see also when you are trying to log it is asking it telling us that unauthorized access is prohibited you can go ahead and put your the password that we put on here i think it is uh this okay after we are now successful we can go ahead and click enable and the enable password is the hano media all right write a typo hano media one okay uh can reach in the configuration like this one and the last password to configure is the SSH, which is now the encrypted uh, Ternet or V2I. To configure this one, we will have to make a domain. And to do that, we can type IP domain uh, name. And let me put koritihano.com. And we will have to make a username. Let me uh, say the username is called uh, admin and the privilege i put 15 and the secret uh it will be uh admin pass um 10 for example you can put whatever you want 
and you can initialize the Ethernet uh, that we made that the Reno Align V2Y4. Uh, uh, yeah, it is 0 and 4. After we initialize that one, we will have to transport input uh, SSH like this one. And we type login local. And we type exit. And we do write the configuration and we are done. That is basically how you can uh, configure all the uh, Cisco passwords on Cisco routers and switches and firewalls. Let me know in the comments if you met with any error. And I hope you guys find this very, very interesting and educative. If you did like this video, go ahead and press like. And if you're coming on this channel for the first time and you find it interesting, don't hesitate to go and subscribe. And turn on the bell icon to get notifications when I made a video. And I will see you next time. Peace out.